Good morning! It is ultrasound day and I'm about to do something to this because it's not quite curly enough to leave alone. So I gotta do something to it. Okay, so I am on my way to work. I gotta go to the bank beforehand. Um, but Lawrence mopped the house this morning. Thanks. Oh, but I hope today is not stressful or irritating because I'm only gonna be there for half day and I don't wanna be stressed out. And I really am just hoping that I have at least one mature follicle, but I have no idea because my ovulation test still said high, but you know, I looked at the line after I pulled it out and it was like barely there. So I have no idea, but I guess I'll find out later today. So I could have swore that my makeup was in the car, but it wasn't. So I came to work with no eyebrows today, but I keep a pencil in my drawer just in case. So I gotta put some eyebrows on. I really dislike using this though. Like, I really dislike using this. It'll work. Bright lights in the big city. Hi, baby. Hey. I love you. Love you. Thanks for fixing my car. Where is my car? Over there. Oh. <laughs> Alrighty, so I'm done working for the day. And I just got in my car and I have a stoplight, so don't freak out. Um, and now it's green. So I am on my way to Panama. I hope it's not gonna rain. It kind of looks a little cloudy, but you know, whatever if it does, it's not gonna hurt my feelings. And hopefully, 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 fingers crossed, I'm going to have at least one mature follicle. And I don't know, I don't think I'm doing a trigger shot, but I guess whenever I get there, I'll talk to them and see what they say. But I don't know. Blow it out. Relax his <laughs> muscles. Oh my goodness gracious. Okay, let's see. Like my heart is pounding so hard right now because I am so anxious to know if I've got anything cooking right now. <laughs> I did shave my legs the other day. You've never felt my legs shave before. <laughs> 
had to lean against him, but I do catch a, a feel every now and then. Oh, how funny. Alright, so apparently I'm seeing Dr. Wolf today. My elbow just slipped. Never seen him before. Um, and I... I was unhappy with my ultrasound. I think I might have one egg that is mature, but the rest of them, like, they were all less than 10. And it caused us to suffer. Is so frustrating but it is only day 12 so at least I had an egg almost an egg I don't know but I guess I'll just wait for him to tell me exactly what because I can only read numbers that are so small and ultrasound tech isn't allowed to tell you anything so I don't know The appointment is over, and um, he said that if I don't get pregnant this time, somebody needs to do a semen analysis, because it's been a year since his surgery, and it could have scar tissue, which would be why I'm not pregnant. Um, because he says that I'm too young to not be pregnant, you know, for trying so long. Um, I had an 18 centimeter follicle, where is it? It's not even on here. It's not even on here. But it was collapsed. And, um, and then he showed me this picture and he was like, do you see all that black stuff right there? That's free fluid. I was like, what does that mean? They're like, you've already ovulated. What? Can you tell me when? I've already ovulated. Um... So, I am going for a 21 day progesterone um, so that we can check my progesterone, see how high or how low it is, and um, let's see what my, my endometrial thickness was only 3.32 millimeters, which is not very thick at all. Um, but yeah, so I, uh, this has been the weirdest cycle ever. Like, on one hand, I was hoping, like, man, wouldn't it be so cool if everything was just wrong and I went today and I had an ultrasound and there was a baby there. And then I was like, man, I just really don't feel like it worked this month. I'm not going to have any eggs. So... Then I saw it and I was like, I don't have any eggs that are big enough. And then I was like trying to squint my eyes and see the screen. I was like, okay, well that one kind of looks big enough, but everything was just weird. And then he came in and he was like, you've already ovulated. I'm like, so if I got pregnant this time, I've already gotten pregnant because I've already ovulated. I don't, I don't get it. I mean, I guess that's the point that I don't get it because I'm supposed to not stressed about it but that's hard and I'm so I still feel so confused but um he said that if the semen analysis comes back and it's not a normal count then we'll just do IUI again because that's you know how they get around that whole low count thing if that's the case. If not, then I'm just going to be pregnant and I'm so confused. I'm so confused. 
But anyways, I'm really ready to go home. I am like tired and my hair looks crazy. But, oh, my HelloFresh box came in today. I'm so excited. So I'm gonna cook a HelloFresh meal tonight. So I will see you guys at home. This is one of my favorite places, because right there, we got married. And I love this dock. I used to dump, I used to dump off this dock. I used to jump off this dock when I was a kid, and it's so nice. I love it out here. And the lake is so pretty and empty right now. There's usually people here, but there's nobody here right now, which is cool. I love it and it's nice and windy outside and it's cloudy and <sighs> relaxing. So this is the meal that the boy has chosen for me to cook tonight. Hey little boy, Good. how was the food? Good. Good? What was the best part? Oh uh, yeah. You just switched it, did it you? No, I didn't. Hey! What was the best part of the food? The uh, fish. The fish? The fish was good, wasn't it? Yeah. And the funny lettuce? <laughs> They're wrestling. And it's comical. Alright, so I have got a kitchen to clean up and a shower to take and clothes to fold and crap to do. So, good night. Hope you enjoyed this today. Um, I knew my ultrasound was going to be weird. But anyways, I will see you guys tomorrow on my next daily vlog. Bye!